What is above my head? Soulmate's name blank 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 blank. You have to guess letters of your soulmate's name or just guess the name. And if you guess it right, you'll meet him. I'm going to guess the letter J. It starts with a J. Oh, that means you're not my soulmate. Maybe it's Jason Derulo. It's not Jason Derulo. Why does it say strike one? That's because you can only guess your soulmate's name or the letters of his name wrong 10 times. After 10 strikes, you're out and you'll never, ever meet your soulmate. That's scary. Oh, no. I'm not going to guess my soulmate's name again until I'm older. I don't want to. Guess what? I guessed my soulmate's name correctly. That means I'll meet him soon. That's great. Have you guessed your soulmate's name yet? No. I haven't guessed my soulmate's name since I was six. I don't want to. Class, we have a new student. Everyone meet Jimmy. Is that my? Hey, mind if I sit here? Hi, Jimmy. Hey, mind if I sit here? Hi, Jimmy. <laughs> Brie, your voice sounded so weird. I know. Um. Sophie, Jimmy is my soulmate. Really? How do you know? Well, my soulmate's name has five letters. Jimmy's name has five letters. Also, it starts with a J. Jimmy's name starts with a J. No way. Jimmy's your soulmate for sure then. Jimmy's over there. Go get your man, girl. Jimmy. I mean, hi, Jimmy. Oh, hey, Brianna. Is everything okay? What's up? I think you're really cute, and I was wondering if I could get your number. Brianna, what are you doing trying to get my boyfriend's number? Boyfriend? Jimmy and I are together. We're dating. Well, that's too darn bad, Timmy. Break up! Jimmy's my soulmate, so we're getting married. But I don't even like women. Are you sure Jimmy's your soulmate? My soulmate's name is Jimmy. <laughs> I guess we need to break up, Pookie. Eyes that can see into the future or eyes that can see into the past? Hmm. Choose. I know no wanna. Choose. Here, Brianna, I have a cookie. What's in the cookie? Cookie. Mmm. Yummy. Mmm. Yummy. Brianna, are you okay? This cookie is dangerous. My cookie. You should be thanking me, Timmy. I just saved your life. I'm heading to work now. Bye, Mom. Hello? This is Officer James. I'm calling because something happened to your mother. She... Mom, don't go to work today. Why? I have to... Just please don't. Okay, I won't. Hello? This is Officer James. I'm calling because... Hello? This is Officer James. I'm calling because something happened to your mother. She was taken by a strange man at her workplace. We don't know the identity of the man, but we're doing everything we can to find her. Well, is she still missing? Uh, yes. Then you're not doing everything you can. Brianna, I overheard your call. Are you okay? Where are you going? I'm going to find my mom. I'll come with you. Come here. Jake! Help, help, Brianna! I'm going by myself, Jake. Don't follow me. Come on, I show me something. Why am I in my childhood home? Mom, mom, are you okay? I, I. Who did this to you? No, no, I wasn't done yet. Come on, I show me more. Any luck finding your mom? Jake, I told you not to come. It's not safe. I was worried about you. Come here. Jake! Help, help, Brianna! Mommy, it's almost the new year. Forget mommy or daddy. No, no, I can't choose. Sweetie, you have to choose before it's the new year, or else you'll forget us both. Five, four, three, two, one. Happy New Year, Mom. Mommy, Happy New Year. Who are you, little girl? Why are you talking to me? I'm your daughter. I don't have a six-year-old. I only have one daughter, and she's 15 years old. Mommy. Oh, no, darling. I think your mother chose to forget you. Who are you? Get away from me, weirdo! That's it. I'm going to get milk. It's that time of year again, Mom. What time of year? Where we choose who we will forget in the new year. Oh, it's that time again? What are your first options? Remember when you chose to forget me when I was six? That was so long ago. You were six years old. We barely had any memories to begin with. But I know you now. I choose. I choose. What were your options? You never told me, sweetie. It was between older sister and grandma. I chose grandma. Good choice. Grandma's old anyways. Yeah. Girl, your fit is so cute. Thank you, bestie. Now, how does my girlfriend get more beautiful every single day? Stop it, babe. 
What's wrong, Bree? I just got my next set of options. No, no, I'm not gonna choose. Brianna, you have to choose because if you don't choose before it gives you the next set of options, you'll forget them both. Who in the new year are you going to forget? It was between Timmy or Jimmy. I chose Jimmy. That's a good choice. Everyone likes Timmy better. I wish my girlfriend was as pretty as you. So leave her and be with me. Don't worry, I will soon. I made the wrong choice. I'm not gonna choose. I wanna forget them both. Oh, babe, you're here. I'm not your babe. Not anymore. Got your pen. Jimmy! Jimmy, catch! Jimmy! Catch, Jimmy! Come on, guys, give me my pen back. Forget Timmy or Jimmy. Hmm. Choose Jimmy! What? No, don't choose me. Timmy's the one who stole your pen in the first place. I'm gonna choose Jimmy. Jimmy! No! I thought you said you got them as an option earlier, Brianna. Why'd you lie to me? Uh, you know what? Don't even tell me. Bestie, wait! Sophie, let me explain. Why didn't you tell me who you actually chose to forget? I didn't tell you because... I chose to forget you over my boyfriend. Oh, I just got an option. Choose to forget you or choose to forget Emma. I choose. I choose. Bessie, please don't choose to forget me. And why not? You chose to forget me. I know and it was a mistake, but you and Emma aren't even that close. If you choose to forget me, then neither of us will ever remember our memories together. And we won't ever meet again. Why would I want to remember someone who chose a boy over their best friend? <laughs> Emma would never do what you did. Goodbye, Brianna. It's one more day till the new year. Almost everyone I care about is going to be forgotten. Forget my cat Oreo or my older sister? No, no, I can't choose. No, I have to choose. I don't want to forget them both. It disappeared. I'm going to forget both of them? 15 seconds until the new year. New year, new me. Forget myself or everyone I've ever known? Brianna, it's almost a new year. Hurry and choose. I'm going to forget myself. Sweetie, I don't think that's a good decision. Happy New Year, everyone. Ah! What are you doing in my house? Who are you? I don't know. Who am I? For some reason, I remember you, but not even myself. You're my mom, right? No, I'm not your mom. I only have one daughter. Oh no, looks like mom chose to forget you again. You don't know who you are because you chose to forget yourself in the new year. But you know who I am, right? Yeah, you're my older sister. And you don't know your own name? No. Your name is I'm a hog. I'm a hog. So when people ask you your name, you'll say? I'm a hog. Hi, Brie. You don't remember me, but... No, my name's I'm a hog. Um, I wanted to introduce myself. I'm Sophie. Sophie, I remember you. You're my best friend, but I thought you chose to forget me. I only said that because I was mad. I would never forget you, Brie. No, it's I'm a ho! Eyes that can see into the future or eyes that can see into the past? Hmm. Choose. I know no Lana. Choose. Here, Brianna, I have a cookie. What's in the cookie? Cookie. Mmm, yummy. Mmm, yummy. Brianna, are you okay? This cookie is dangerous! Ow! My cookie! You should be thanking me, Timmy! I just saved your life! I'm heading to work now. Bye, Mom! Hello? This is Officer James. I'm calling because something happened to your mother. She... Mom, don't go to work today. Why? I have to... Just please don't! Okay, I won't! Hello? This is Officer James. I'm calling because... Hello? This is Officer James. I'm calling because something happened to your mother. She was taken by a strange man at her workplace. We don't know the identity of the man, but we're doing everything we can to find her. Well, is she still missing? Uh, yes. Then you're not doing everything you can. Brianna, I overheard your call. Are you okay? Where are you going? I'm going to find my mom. I'll come with you. Come here. Jake! Help, help, Brianna! I'm going by myself, Jake. Don't follow me. Come on, I show me something. Why am I in my childhood home? Mom, mom, are you okay? I, I. Who did this to you? No, no, I wasn't done yet. Come on, I show me more. Any luck finding your mom? Jake, I told you not to come. It's not safe. I was worried about you. Come here. Jake. Help, help, Brianna. 
bombastic. Bombastic? Oh no, Jimmy, did you just get a TikTok sound? You have to say the rest of the sound. Answer carefully because if you answer it wrong, you die. Bombastic. They call me Mr. Bombastic. Bumble fantastic. No, Jimmy! <laughs> it was Bombastic sign I. Are you off to school, honey? Yeah, Grandma. We need cash. We need cash? Why am I hearing voices? Oh no, Grandma, did you just get a TikTok sound? You have to say the rest of it. We need cash. Give me my money, you world! Grandma! <laughs> Grandma! I'ma grow up and be an astronaut. <laughs> I'm on a Mexican radio. Hey girl, how are you doing today? Not good. My grandma couldn't finish the rest of the TikTok sound this morning. I said him. I said him. Brianna, what's wrong? I just got a TikTok sound. I said a Come on, you have to say the rest of the sound. I said a boom. Come on, hurry. I'm trying to think. I said a boom chicka boom. I said a boom chicka rocka chicka rocka chicka boom. I got it. I'm so glad you're safe. Come on, let's go to class. Okay. Okay. What is this? You just got a TikTok sound, didn't you? I know this one. What are you doing? What were we just about to do? I think I know the rest of the sound. Okay, let's go to class. No! It was okay, let's go. There's my beautiful girlfriend. What's wrong, baby? My best friend couldn't say the TikTok sound correctly. I think I'm just gonna go home early today. One, two. One, two. I just got a TikTok sound. One, two. Babe, I know the answer for this one. One, two. Buckle my shoe. No, babe, you're not allowed to give the answer. You're only allowed to give in. I forgot. <laughs> baby. Answer now or be eliminated. One, two, buckle my shoe. Three, four, buckle some more. Five, six, Nike kicks. Where do you think you're going? Out. Jump scare. I'm going home. No, you're not allowed to leave the school without a note from your mother. My boyfriend just passed away. That's not my problem. Now go to class. Mommy, look what I can do. What the? Mommy? Mommy, that's not something you should be calling one of your students. No, it's a Tic Tac sound. Mommy, look what I can do. Mommy, look what I can do. What are you doing? I'm giving you a hint. It's an audio from this amazing POV Girls video. I don't know the answer. She must be a nobody. It was Ewa Ewa. The principal's gone. That means I can finally go home. No, you can't go. You have to learn. Let me go, Eugene. Side eye. Side eye? Did you just get a TikTok sound? You're not smart enough to guess it right. <laughs> Side eye. Let her go, Eugene. Timmy. Let's get out of here. Thanks for getting me out of there, Timmy. Eugene is really weird. It was no problem. Anyways, I'm heading home now. You know what it never was? I just got a TikTok sound. You know what it never was? Uh, that serious. It was never that serious. Timmy, you got it. I'm safe. Anyways, I'll see you later. Bye. You're not going anywhere. Frick. You're not going anywhere. Frick. Frick. This is going to be a problem, isn't it? Timmy, please just let me go home. I want to see my family. At least you have a home, a family. Everyone I know and love is gone because they couldn't say the TikTok sound correctly. If I don't get to see my family again, neither do you. Say bye-bye, Brianna. Ashley! Ashley? I just got a TikTok sound. Give me a hint now. Ashley, look at the floor. Ashley, look at the floor. You really thought I'd give you the right hint, Timmy? It was Ashley, look at me. There you are, now get to class! Just leave me alone, Eugene! Okay, well, that's interesting. You need to learn! Okay, well, that's interesting. You know why? Why? Because... Honey, you're home early. Mom, today's been the worst day. When is this game gonna end? Happy, happy, happy! Oh, no. I'm so nervous for who my soulmate is gonna be. Don't be. You're Santa's daughter. I'm sure you'll get someone just as jolly as you are. I don't know. I really hope it's the Tooth Fairy's son because he's super cute. <gasps> 
Who is it? Uh, I got the Easter Bunny's son. Your soulmate's a rabbit? Yeah, probably because I like carrots so much. I have to go now. Bye! Jack Frost has a son? Oh, I bet he's on the naughty list. You bet who's on the naughty list? Oh, hi, Mom. Hi, Holly. I think your father wants to speak with you. He's in his office. Okay. Santa, your daughter's here to see you. <laughs> Hello, Holly. Hi, Dad. So, have you found out who your soulmate is the son of? Nope. Hmm. Is that so? Emergency! Emergency! All the toy machines have been frozen! <laughs> Sounds like the work of Jack Frost. I'll be right back, Holly. Well, hello. Don't believe we've met. Name's Jared. Jared Frost. Bet you're wondering who froze the toy machines. It was you, wasn't it? Wow. Pretty and smart. Maybe you are my type after all. Hey! I told you to stop following me. Have you told your dad we're soulmates? No. Have you? Nope. And I'm not going to. Well, we can't just keep lying to them. But we have to. If your dad found out, he'd cancel Christmas. You think so? Oh, yeah. Things would get real ugly. Holly, where are you? And that's my cue to go. Jared! Santa's looking for you. Ho, oh, oh. ho. There she is. We thought we heard you talking to someone. Really? That's funny. <laughs> Holly, we wanted to tell you the toy machines are fixed. Great. But now we need to know. Who your soulmate is the son of. Please tell me it's father time. I'm actually not feeling so well. I think I need fresh air. Oh no. Okay. I hate lying to them, but I can't let Christmas get cancelled. What am I gonna do? Holly! Jared? Don't move. I'm pretty sure I can fix the ice. That's not very comforting. No, I can do it. Just hang on. Hey, it's working. You should be good to cross now. Give me your hand. Wait, I don't know. What if you're tricking me? I'm not tricking you. I promise. Let me see your hand. Okay. I won't let you fall. That's it. Nice. <gasps> Whoa. Hey, you all right? Mm -hmm. I'm probably going to end up on the naughty list for lying. My dad is going to be so disappointed in me. Well, I'm used to that. My dad. He thinks I'm worthless. Really? Yeah. It's because I haven't mastered my powers yet. You seem pretty good at using your powers to me. Thanks. Want to see something cool? Sure. <clears throat> it's okay. Try again. Oh, Jared, it's beautiful. You really are. <clears throat> I mean, it's beautiful, but you are too. What are you doing, Dad? We were just talking, Jack. It's Mr. Frost to you, and I know flirting when I see it. No son of mine will be with a Kringle. Stop! That isn't fair. Ow! Dad, let go! No, son. We're leaving. And he's never going to see you again. It's okay, Holly. Just go! Mom, Dad, why are you guys looking at me like that? Because for the first time in 18 years... You, Holly, are on the naughty list. Okay, I can explain. It's because I haven't been very truthful about who I got as a soulmate. Why? Who did you get, Holly? The son of Jack Frost. What? <gasps> what? His whole family is cold-hearted. But Jared is different. Ho oh, oh. ho. Frosts are nothing but bad news. And you, young lady, are grounded for lying to us. That's right. You heard your mother. Go to your room. I have to save Jared. Who knows what Jack Frost is doing to him? Holly, I could help you. Winky, what are you doing here? Well, you see, I may or may not have been eavesdropping on you all day. Actually, I could use your help. Sweet, because I've already hatched a plan on how you can save Jared. You have? I'm a sucker for a good forbidden love story, plus <laughs> I totally ship you guys. Winky. Step one is to get your mom and dad to take an afternoon snooze, which has already been completed. But they never take afternoon naps. Well, let's just say I gave them some special milk and cookies. <gasps> Winky! Sorry, it was the only way, but come with me. I think Jared's in danger. This is the house, and I overheard Jack telling Jared he's gonna lock him in the basement. Okay, you distract Jack, and I'll go save Jared. Deal. Rudolph the red-nosed reindeer had a very shiny- Stop! What the heck, Stacy? <laughs> Girl, look up. I just saved your life. They banned Christmas music. This is ridiculous. I was just starting to get into the Christmas spirit. Who is that? It's Mr. Smith. He's singing Jingle Bells. He has his AirPods in. Mr. Smith, stop! One horse open. No, 
Whoa! Sweetheart, you gotta smile. It's picture day. Come on. I don't feel like smiling. Well, you know what? At least take this brush and comb your hair a little before I take your picture, okay? Uh-oh. Not today. Ew! You got me right in the Sorry. eye! Sorry! Hey, babe, what are you doing? Well, brushes are banned, so I figured I would try a fork. <laughs> what are you, the little mermaid? We have to break we up. We need to break up. No more Mr. Smith, no more boyfriend, but at least I still have you. Oh, no, they don't. Anyone with a dog has to hand it over to me. We have to hide you. Ma'am, you do realize dogs are banned. Of course, but fortunately for Billy, he's not a dog. Uh-huh, nice try. Hand over the dog or else... Damn it. Yes! So glad dogs aren't banned anymore. Oh my gosh, I know, right? I'm glad yours didn't get taken. Hey, I like your notebook. Thanks, I got it from the Brianna Missouri merch store. Oh, cool. <gasps> Someone is seriously out to get me. <laughs> oh gosh, why does it smell so bad in here? Sorry, did you see what they banned this morning? I mean, come on. They banned deodorant, not showers. If I don't have deodorant, then I don't shower. Hey, since boyfriends are unbanned, do you want to get back together with me? I kind of want to get to know you more. Yeah, I was thinking the same thing. Sweet. And here comes another banned item. <laughs> wow, they just banned dresses. <laughs> Wait, what? I'm wearing a dress. Guess I'm really going to get to know you now. I oh! am not taking this off. Help me hide. Come on. Please, I'm sorry. I didn't mean to wear a... This way. Let's go. I can't shave my head, okay? I really can't. Yeah, I know. This is a really bad one. Emergency. Change the band item. How did you just do that? I... Look, there's something you need to know about me. My dad's in charge of this system. How could you not tell me this? It's a secret. I'm not supposed to tell. So you could change the band item whenever you want? Why didn't you change it when it's said dress? It's not like my dad just does whatever I say. It's only for emergency purposes. Please don't be mad at me. How does your dad even know to change the stuff? He has a microphone on me that he'll listen to. He's kind of a psychopath. Yeah, no kidding. Please, wait. I need to be alone. If you're creeped out that my dad's always listening, he doesn't listen all the time. Uh Necklaces are banned. Is your dad out to get me or something? No, I mean, maybe... This is stupid. If you really care about me, have your dad end this whacked up system. Don't you think I've tried? Please, just take off the necklace. Fine. It's stuck. Hey, looks like we got a lawbreaker over here. Jake. Guys, don't shoot. You know who I am. Her necklace is stuck. Oh, you're Jake's girlfriend. Come here. Take them both to his father. Get off of me! I'm wearing a dress. Guess I'm really gonna get to know you now. Oh. I'm not taking this off. Help me hide. Come on. Please, I'm sorry. I didn't mean to wear a- This way. Let's go. I know you're freaking out, but I have an idea. We cut your dress in half. What? It'll be a two-piece. Jake, that's actually a great idea. Right? <laughs> okay, hand me the scissors. I don't know, your hands are kind of shaky, so... Jake, I'm fine. Just hand me the scissors. Uh, I feel like I should do it, to be honest. Jake! I'm kidding. Chill. Here, take the... I'm safe! <sighs> but I'm not. Can you close your eyes, maybe? Please tell me you're wearing boxers. I mean, yeah, but still, just close your eyes, okay? Thanks. I appreciate you keeping your eyes closed. Mm -hmm. It's been an hour. <laughs> they better unban pants soon. What? What are you laughing at? No, it's just, um... Why do your boxers say Merry Rismus? Hey! Sorry, I might have looked just for a second. Ugh, they were a gift. Stop, stop looking. Please tell me I can open my eyes now. Uh, you might not want to. Why? Well, because... That's why. I can't shave my head, okay? I really can't. Yeah, I know, this is a really bad one. Emergency! Change the band item. How did you just do that? I... Look, there's something you need to know about me. Looks like we got a lawbreaker over here. Jake. Guys, don't shoot. You know who I am. Her necklace is stuck. Oh, you're Jake's girlfriend. Come here. Take them both to his father. Get off of me. Sit in the elimination chair and don't let go of him. Yes, ma'am. Elimination chair? Jake, what is she talking about? I won't let them do anything to you. We shall see about that, son. Dad, let her go. She didn't break the law. Her necklace got stuck. Lies. She was just testing you. Is that true? I... She never tried to unlock her necklace. I have the camera footage to prove it. She was probably just trying to see if I was going to stand up for her. And you know what? I don't blame her for not trusting me when I have a father like you. Well, let's see how much you truly care about her. Oops. Now it looks like you both are breaking the law. I'll let you choose one person to live. It's okay. Just choose to save yourself. No, Dad. I'm not going to make that choice. Just end the system. 
You know I can't do that. Then go ahead and end me. Wrong answer. <laughs> Wrong answer. Oh, Dad, don't! Please, please wait. You must learn, son, to never put a woman first in your relationship. What the? Real interesting philosophy you have about relationships. It's no wonder ours ended in divorce. Mom? What the hell do you think you're doing? <laughs> Banning something that should actually be illegal. Goodbye goon number one, and goodbye goon number two. <gasps> That's for taking my son away from me. Mom, you, you just killed Dad. I know, honey. It had to be done. Hey, sweetheart, open your eyes. We have to get out of here. Come on, you can trust me. <sighs> Thanks. This way. Where are we? The room with the deactivation button. What? Well, what are you waiting for? Press it! No! Whoever presses the button dies. Mom, I'll press it. Jake, no, please. The system has to be stopped. You're right, but not by you. No, no. Mom! I love you. <laughs> mom? No, Mom. The system's down. She saved everyone. My parents, they're... they're both gone. Jake, I'm so sorry. <sighs> Promise. Promise you won't ever leave me. Jake, I promise. It's gonna be okay. Yeah, she... she would have wanted us to be happy. We have to run. <laughs> you okay? <laughs> yeah, are you okay? Yeah. From now on, we're gonna stick together, right? Always. I'm so glad I have you. Me too. There's something I've been meaning to do. My soulmate controls my brain or my hand? Um, I'm not picking brain because I refuse to think in boy math, so um, I guess that means I'm gonna go with hand. Hand. I wonder what hand he's gonna be controlling. Okay, guess it's this one then. <laughs> yeah, this is gonna be weird. Honey, you better not have picked to let your soulmate control your hand. What? Of course not. No, I, um, I picked brain. Oh boy, okay, you poor thing. You probably lost so many brain cells. My gosh, are you gonna be okay? Yeah, I really just need to go get ready for that Thanksgiving party. Bye-bye. I don't know what dress to wear for the party, the red one or the green one. I mean, it looks nice enough. I'll try it on. All right, you know what? This dress is pretty cute. I like it. Okay, okay, we have to go to the party now. Hey Brie, nice dress! Thanks! <laughs> okay, can we please stop doing this dance move? Can you please stop it? Hey, you know it's me that's the one who's controlling you, right? <laughs> Wait, really? Yeah, if you come with me, I can prove it to you. I'm sorry, but if you're really my soulmate, why is my finger saying no? Well, let me show you. Come on over here with me. Hey! Relax, beautiful. I I better go. Oh. I'm sorry, are you like some sort of MMA fighter? Because what the heck was that? It was self-defense. He was trying to put his hands on you. Yeah, I know, but did you really have to go all karate kid on him? Yes, yes I did. You could have gotten me in a lot of trouble. You're lucky that guy's gonna be okay. I'm sorry, please don't be mad at me. If you don't want me to be mad at you, then just tell me your address and I can meet you in person. Hello? Write something. Do you not want to meet up with me? You know what? Forget this. Hey, are you serious? Oh, so now you want to talk to me? I want to meet up with you, but I can't because it's dangerous. Great excuse. I'm serious, you could already be in danger. Okay, you know what? I've had enough of these jokes. You owe me a new lipstick. I am gonna get ready to go to sleep. Oh my gosh! Please tell me that's you at my door. It's midnight, so if it's not you, then... Are you Jason's soulmate? Who? Answer his question. Whoa, listen guys, I don't even know my soulmate's name. If I were you, I would leave right now because whoever he is, he's controlling my hand and he seems to know how to fight pretty well. Huh, that has to be Jason. Yeah, must be. Get her. Hey, he's trying to challenge us to a fight. No, no, don't listen to him. Don't come here. Nah, go ahead. Try and fight me using a girl hand because I... Ah, uh, it got me right in the eye. Oh. Ooh, I am so sorry about that, but I did warn you, you know. Huh? Oh. Ugh. You haven't won just yet. I don't think so. Did you not just see what my soulmate just did to those last two guys? So you can only imagine what he's gonna do to you. 
<laughs> Come on, now is not the time to quit on me. <laughs> you know what that means? Your soulmate is probably dead. Oh, and so now, there's no one left to save you. You know what that means? Your soulmate is probably dead. There's no one left to save you. Huh, not so tough when you can't use your hands, now are you? I don't understand. What do you guys want with me? Your soulmate owes us a lot of money, and we were going to use you as bait to get to him. But we're going to make a call, and if we find out that he's really dead, then you will be too. He can't be dead. My hand is moving, which means he must still be... Hey, shh. Are you Jason? Yeah, shh. Keep your voice down. I have a plan to save us both. Okay, even though you're free now, pretend you're not. I'm going to hide back here. They're coming. It's going to be fine. Remember, I have a plan. He's still alive, so we're moving you to a different lo- oh, oh, oh. Not today. Oh. Hey, Jason, surrender now or I'll kill her. <laughs> yeah, bird brain. Did you forget I'm still controlling her hand? Huh? Hey, listen. Yes, Mr. Super Spy? <laughs> well, I heard if we kiss, it'll make me stop controlling your hand. Oh. So, good idea, bad idea? You know, I say it's, it's worth a, a shot. Day. Sweet. It's a new life. Whoa, it totally worked! And now, it's asking me if I want to control your hand. I don't think that's a good idea, since you don't really know how to fight, and, you know, with my job. Hey! Well, it looks like you're just gonna have to teach me. Why, you little... <laughs> la 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 la... Can I play with one of your toys, too? No. Why not? Because you're not my real sister. Yes, we are. Sasha said she said that we are. You're literally just proving my point. You call her Sasha, not mom. When I get a real baby sister, that's when I'll share my toys. Thank you for saving us from that evil girl. Yeah, she was so mean to us. Don't worry, guys. I promise I won't let her touch you again. Hey, Sasha. So I was wondering, since it's almost Halloween, do you think I could get some money for a costume? If you want one, Jane, buy it yourself. But you bought one for Anna. Yes, but that's that's different. Whatever. My mom said that when she was a baby, they found her on the side of the highway. <gasps> no way. Her real parents just ditched her like that? It's no wonder that she has so many issues. Right? That makes so much more sense now. <laughs> okay, girlies, let's go do our Halloween makeup, and then we'll get into our costumes. Yay! Look at this new makeup palette I got. Wait a minute. Are those my stuffed animals from when I was little? No. Uh-huh. And where did you get the money to buy that costume? I found some money on the street. You little thief! Give me that hey. bucket! Oh my gosh, is this your little stash of all my stuff? Mom, come here and look at this. <gasps> you don't even use any of that. It doesn't matter. I will not allow a thief to live in my home. So what? You're gonna kick me out? As a matter of fact, I will. Whatever, I don't need you guys anyways. I know you only adopted me, so you could look good in front of your rich friends. Oh, how dare you. Here, this is all the money I'm giving you. Good luck living on the streets. You know, I'm pretty sure this is illegal. No, dear, you're 18 now. This will be good for you, Jane. It was nice knowing you, honey. <laughs> <laughs> Have fun being broken homeless. <laughs> you know what? The heck with them. But I promised you guys I would not leave you with her. I promise I won't let her touch you again. Excuse me, miss. Do you have any spare money? I'm so hungry. How about this, hun? I'll give you $20 for those two stuffed animals. You know what? Deal. Uh-oh, I only have pocket change. But you said you would give me 20 This isn't worth it. Sorry, honey. I gotta go. Give me back my stuffed animals. Bye. See ya. Hey! Wait a minute. She dropped her credit card. I hope she doesn't mind me going on a little shopping spree. Ow! Oh, goodness. I am so sorry. Yeah, yeah. Not. Excuse me, miss. Is your name Jane? No. Freeze! Jane 5, cop 0. Excuse me, miss. I'm homeless, and I was wondering if you have any money. What do you say you come work for me? Okay. Pretending to be your daughter was the perfect distraction. I told you, they never suspect a mother-daughter duo. And this is nothing, kid. If you stick with me, I got a lot more tricks where this came from. Hey, you two. They must know we stole. Stay calm, kid. I got this. Excuse me, officer. There's just been a misunderstanding. I- Officer, help! She's trying to kidnap me! What? I thought we were a team. Hands on your head. I'm sorry. I can't go to jail. I'm sorry. I can't go to jail. This isn't over, kid. Come on, let's go. Okay, you get one phone call. Hurry up. Come on, pick up. Pick up, damn it. Hello? Hey, Kate, it's me. Who? It, it's Jane. Remember I helped you steal... 
I mean, I helped you borrow that car one time. Oh, yes, Jane, I remember you. Yeah, listen, I am in a bit of a jam. I am currently in jail, and I'm gonna need you to bail me out. What? Wait, wait, how did that happen? It's a long story, I don't want to talk about it, but uh, let's just say I'm never having kids. <laughs> you always did have a soft spot, didn't you? Okay, are you gonna help me or not? Depends, is there going to be revenge? Um, it's me, duh. Then I'm in. See you soon, Jane. Next. What do we got here, Jane Danvers? Okay, here's your stuff. Get out. I can't believe she took your car, too. Yeah, I know. That little brat was a con artist herself. But she's gonna wish she didn't mess with me. You remember the plan? Sure do. Let's do this. Oh, hey! Oh, pardon me. I'm such a klutz. Hey. <gasps> J Jane, how did you get out of prison? I, uh, I got bailed out, no thanks to you. About how I took your car and turned you in, You I... were just trying to save yourself. Exactly, so you're not mad, right? Nah, come here, give me a hug. Okay. <laughs> oh my gosh, ma'am, I just saw that girl take your wallet. What? No, I didn't. Yeah, she did, it's right there in her back pocket. Hey! I didn't take her stupid wallet, she did this! Oh my gosh, please don't hurt me. Oh, no. Oh, no. Someone call the police. You're coming with us. Get off of me, I'm telling you it was her. Later, traitor. Why, you little bit! You should have showed her, Jane. Never tried out, Conacon -con woman. Precisely. Cat sit for a millionaire or babysit for a billionaire. I do love cats, but I am allergic, and I think the billionaires are gonna pay more. Thank you for coming. How does 5,000 an hour sound? 5,000? Mm hmm. Is that too low for you? No, no, that's plenty. Excellent. Okay, let me see. Let me just go get the kids. This is Tabitha and Thomas. Now let's go over the rules. Okay. And lastly, bedtime is at eight. Question, when you say the kids aren't allowed outside, how do they go to school? Tabitha is homeschooled. Oh, okay. And of course our son is just a baby. Time for us to go. Yes, don't you worry, Mr. and Mrs. Parker. Your kids are in great hands. Five little monkeys jumping on the bed. One fell off and bonked his head. Oh, it's already eight o'clock. It's time for bed. Uh, Sarah? Yes? Sometimes I dream that I have a different mommy and daddy and I get scared. They're just dreams, sweetheart. You sleep well, okay? Good night. Good night, Sarah. I can't believe I'm working for billionaires. Is that blood? And it just dripped on me from the attic. You saw blood. Yeah, and I'm just a bit concerned because... <laughs> <laughs> blood in the I, attic. I don't really see how this is funny. The blood must have been from our Halloween decorations. We stole them in the attic. <laughs> oh, I'm so sorry, guys. I may have overreacted a bit. Oh, you poor thing. You were probably terrified. Here's a one hundred dollar gift card for your troubles. Well, thank you, but are you sure you don't want my help cleaning up all that mess? No, thank you, but can you watch the kids next Saturday? Yes, of course. Excellent. See you then. Bye-bye now. Please make sure Tabitha does not go in the guest bedroom. We're renovating it and it's not safe for children. Yes, of course. Understood. <gasps> Sarah! Tabitha, hi! Are you ready to play some games? <laughs> yeah, I missed you. Come on, follow me. I want to play in here. No, no, Tabitha, you're not supposed to go in there. Tabitha, I really don't appreciate you not listening. I saw we. I thought your parents said they were renovating this room. W what does renovating mean? <laughs> it means like to fix it up and make it pretty. It's already pretty. Is that blood on the countertop? Huh? You know what, I'm sorry. It's probably just from your Halloween decorations. Mommy and Daddy, they, they don't decorate for Halloween. What? Mommy and Daddy, they, they don't decorate for Halloween. What? The blood must have been from our Halloween decorations. And that means this blood must be real. If that blood was real, then I'm lucky to have made it home alive. But whose blood would it have been? Sometimes I dream that I have a different mommy and daddy and I get scared. What if Mr. and Mrs. Parker killed Tabitha and Thomas's real parents and that was their blood in the attic? It's them. Hello? We need you, ASAP. Thank you for agreeing to come. See you. See you. If something really is going on there, I'm gonna have to prove it. So when Mr. and Mrs. Parker leave, I'm gonna investigate the attic myself. Hopefully this is tall enough to reach the attic. 
Say, well, what are you doing? Tabitha, I told you to go watch Coco Melon. No, I want to be with you. What's that? It's an Amber Alert for a missing baby, and it's a picture of your baby brother. I think these kids were kidnapped. What's going on? There's no time to explain, sweetheart. We have to go. <laughs> I'm scared. Shh, it's gonna be okay. They're home. What's going on? There's no time to explain, sweetheart. We have to go. <laughs> I'm scared. Shh, it's gonna be okay. They're home. Sarah, please don't hide. We know you saw the Amber Alert, but we can explain. Tabitha? She's calling me. She's trying to trick you. I told you. She's not your real mom. I think they're gone. Are you gonna call the police? My phone died. <laughs> Shh, Thomas, stop crying. <laughs> Found you. Don't be scared. Just because the kids are stolen. It doesn't mean we don't love them. No, you leave the children alone. Yeah. Oh. Tabitha. <sighs> what a shame. You're just like our last babysitter. What did you do to her? The blood in the attic. That was hers, and now you're- oh, oh. Surprise! I'm still alive. Susie! I'm okay. Just call the police. Go get help. Come on, Tabitha, let's go. Thank you for finding my daughter. And thank you for finding my son. You should really thank the other babysitter. She- she was the real hero. It was both of you. You both are responsible for reuniting two children back with their families. I'm glad everyone's okay. Me too. Tabitha wanted to know if you would still want to be her babysitter? Yeah, please. I'm gonna have to go with... Yes. <gasps> Yay! Get a giant teddy bear or become an adult? What kind of options are these? I'm gonna have to go with... Honey, don't pick your wish until I get back from vacation. Fine. Bye, Mom. Bye, and while I'm gone, your big sister's in charge. Yes. Thanks, Mom. I promise I'll take great care of her. Let me see that. Hey! Sorry, but I'm not having you turn into one of those iPad kids. No more iPad for you. No, sissy. Bye. <laughs> <laughs> She's so mean. Hmm. If I can be older than sissy, then I can boss her around. What the heck? Nothing even happened to me. Oh, I feel sleepy. Oh, that was a really long nap. My voice, it sounds different. <gasps> it worked! Alright, if you want your iPad back... <gasps> Who are you and what did you do with my little sister? Sissy, no, listen, it's me! Yeah, right, you creep. Where is she? Please, put those scissors down, you're scaring me. Tell me something only my sister would know. Um... Tell me something only my sister would know. Oh, when I was three, I flushed your goldfish down the toilet because I thought I was saving its life. <gasps> There's no way you could have known about that unless... Sadie? Duh, who else would it be? Why do you look like this? You look like a younger version of mom. Well, I kind of sort of used my Christmas wish. You wish to become an adult? Sadie! This is all your fault, really, because you're the one that locked me in my room and took away my iPad. So now that I'm an adult, I order you to give it back to me. <laughs> just because you look like an adult doesn't mean I'm treating you like one. Okay, fine. Then I'll just go to the store and buy one myself, because I found a driver's license and a credit card in my pocket. <gasps> you wouldn't dare. Try me. Sadie, wait! Oh, I cannot believe I'm letting you drive me right now. I told you, I've done so many car simulation games that I'm practically a pro at driving at this point. There's a tumbleweed! We are going in and out of this- Hey, beautiful. Store. Is there any chance I could get your number? No, sir, she is eight years old. <laughs> Funny. The answer is no. L let's go. You're not getting that. You're getting age-appropriate clothes. No, I like my clothes and I want this. Sadie? Don't you dare start crying. <laughs> oh my god, is she okay? Do I need to call the police? <laughs> no, ma'am. <sighs> good morning, sissy. No, Sadie, it is not a good morning. I cannot believe you suckered me into letting you buy that. Well, if you didn't, they were gonna call the cops since I was crying so much. Yeah, I know. Wait a minute, your hair looks different. Did you get it done? Do you like it? Yeah, it looks great, except for the fact that you snuck out without telling me. I don't have to tell you anything, because I'm an adult now. You need to take back your wish. No, I like being grown up. Sadie, you don't get what it's actually like to be grown up. You don't see how much I've been taking care of you. I can take care of myself. Oh, yeah? You know what? I'm leaving. Sissy... No, you should see what it's really like to be an adult. How hard could cooking breakfast actually be? I can make mac and cheese in a pan, right? I'll just let it boil on high for one hour. Ooh, 
That must be my delivery. This giant dollhouse better be easy to assemble. Why is this instruction manual so confusing? And now my eyesight isn't as good as it was before. <gasps> my mac and cheese! <laughs> Okay, are we ready to start? Um, wait, actually, we're waiting on one more. Please tell me you did not, like, invite Gerald. Hi, I'm right here. Um, I didn't invite you. How did you find my house? It's in the school directory. Well, I was invited. This time. You're my best friend. I kind of didn't have a choice. I thought I was your best friend. I love how I have to sit on the floor, but I was part of this friend group first. So, who's the one we're waiting on? Nova. Oh, shit. Oh, is she, like, mentally sane again? Yeah, she's, like, doing great, I guess. And she's going back to school after break. I don't know, Nova. What happened to her? Emma cheated on her and she had a mental breakdown. Oh. Oh my god. Don't like just look at me. I cheated on her with Brody. Oh my god, why is it always like the girl that's the slut? It wasn't even that good. It shouldn't have even counted. So everyone has slept with Brody? Yeah. Not me. Emma, I think you're more to blame because you were the one in the relationship with Nova. I didn't like mean to cheat. Oh, that must be Nova. Hey everyone, I missed you guys. Hello, I'm British. Well, actually, I don't know like half of you, and I hate Emma now, so. Hi. Nice to meet you. Hi, welcome. You can. So wherever. Okay. Nova, you look great. Thank you. Yeah, all I needed was a grippy sock vacation to cure me. Okay, well, let's get this party started. Like pink. What? What? The singer. No, bad joke. Nova, since you haven't gotten to do anything fun in a really long time, why don't you go first? My grippy sock vacation was pretty fun, but okay. I wouldn't know, but grab the gift that says Nova. What the hell is this for? To draw on your face because you're emo. Why would I put permanent marker on my face? Is that not what you use? Are you stupid? Brody, you just gave yourself away. You're supposed to let her try to guess who it's from. Nobody told me the rules. Okay, let's just move on. This my grippy socks. This is the best gift I could have gotten. I go through a lot of this. That's disgusting. Guess who your secret Santa was? Was it JJ? No, why on earth would you think I would get you queen? Be because of that time in science class. We had that moment with the cream? Uh, no, it wasn't like that. He just rubbed some cream on my hand. I wasn't your secret Santa. Move on. Hmm. <laughs> Gerald, did you buy me a big bottle of cream? You got it from your secret Santa. Gerald, how did you have a secret Santa for the party if you weren't even invited? So you just bought me cream for fun? Um, yeah, I knew you would use it. Gerald, you are so weird. Please leave my house. No, please. Please let me at least open my gift first. Nobody got you a gift because you weren't part of the secret Santa. Nobody got me a gift. Gerald, get out of my house. Okay. Wait, so do I have another gift? Oh, yep, it's right here. Okay, I totally thought that was gonna be like so funny, but that just made it so awkward, so. Don't worry, I'll use both. Emma, um, you've been really quiet. Are you okay? Or is it just really awkward to be right next to someone you cheated on? <laughs> okay, I'm bored. I want it to be my turn. Oh, I'll look for yours for you. Okay. Um, I don't see it. Huh. I'm not seeing it either. Um, does anybody see my gift? Wait, did nobody have me for their secret Santa? Okay, I'm like a little confused. So like, I got you like a secret Santa. You picked my name? Yeah, and I got you like a secret Santa. But now I'm starting to think that like I did it wrong. What do you mean you got me a secret Santa? Emma, who the hell is at the door? your secret Santa. 